Welcome back to RealVacantLand.com where we have fun buying and selling land. Let's take a look at this one. I'm, I like this property. I've seen this property. I think I might have made a video or maybe it was a TikTok video about this one in the past. Maybe not a YouTube video. But uh, check this out. It's 115 acres. That's a lot of land. 115 acres. How long would it take you to walk around a 115 acre property? I think, you know, it would be a good walk. It, it's walking through the bush like that. Hopefully you got some tall boots on. Uh, but uh, 115 acres in Oregon. Let's take a look at this property. So I got it pulled up on a map over here. Not exactly pulled up yet. I thought I'd zoom in. I'd do a little sales pitch on my map for the whole website of all the land that we've got on the website, ruralvacantland.com is on this map. And uh, we're going to Oregon. So my hand disappears, but here we go. Oregon's up here. The property's in this general area. We'll zoom in on it. So we've got properties in lots of different states, but this one's in Oregon just north of California, south of Washington, on the west coast of the U.S. So we've got a grouping of properties down here. This is Klamath Falls. This is uh, Klamath County, I believe. We've had numerous properties, and uh, we've got a couple left for sale. So as we zoom in, we've got one kind of in the middle. I think this is the one that I was looking at. If I remember right, but we've got some over here. We've got some other ones scattered around the area. If this one's sold, you're looking at others. Um, go check out the area. It's a rural area. There's not very many people around. Uh, it's pretty easy, open for uh, building and making it happen. It's got this river that flows through here, the Sprague River, I think it's called. And if you look that river up, you see pictures of people like kayaking, which it looks like I should just throw my kids in the car and go up there and go kayak. Maybe not this time of year, but the right time of year, go kayak and take some fishing poles. So fly, I do fly fishing pole, maybe a spinning, spin casting kind of rod for my kids. But uh, go catch some trout, see what's in there. It just looked like a really good river for, for kayaking and canoeing. Um, so this property is not very far away from that. Let's click on it here. Yeah, here this is the right one. 115 acres, same picture I had in the background. So we'll click on that. We'll pull it up. The, the owner of this property is Aaron English. Aaron English has got his name and number, his phone number's up here. Great guy to do, do deals with. Give him a call if you have questions about this property or other properties like it. He's got numerous different properties. And um, his phone number's right up there. So if you're in this, watching this video on your phone, you can go down to the description of this video, click on the link, it'll take you to the website, and then it'll show you uh, his phone number on there. Click on it, and you can call him and start asking questions. So there is, uh, he's got the financing up here. He's, he's asking 49779 or $5,000 down and $500 a month. So he's got a payment plan. So you could do a payment plan on 115 acres. You know, that's a lot of land. So you could go and make payments on it and have fun with it and go for it. So here's the property. Let's pull this up. And it's, uh, it's a weird shape property. There's an old trail running along here. I think must be the, the border, the northern border of the property. And maybe that's why that weird shape is going on there. And someone split it along that trail, I'm guessing, somewhere in the past. Yeah, the trail's still kind of there. It's like an old wagon train trail or something. But there's the property. I mean, that's a big, big, big chunk of land. You could ride horses around on there, dirt bikes, or shoot off fireworks. I mean, just go for it. Big, big chunk of land. Um, <laughs> the description says this property is ginormous. <laughs> there you go. Uh, so we've got, uh, you know, you can click, click and buy it over here. You can click, click, put it on payments over here. We've got all the tax information, details of the property, so you can check it out with the county. We've got GPS coordinates over here, so you can click on it and get driving directions to go out and see the property. We've got GPS coordinates over here, so you can walk around the outline of the property and go tour this property, right? might take you a day to go all the way around it. If you start at sun up and circle it by sundown, looking up GPS coordinates and stuff on the way, it's going to be a good long walk. Um, size 115 acres and there's a legal description the elevation is kind of 4600 feet basically and he's got a video about this one too so aaron made a video about it um i think this might be like drone shots or pictures i'm not exactly sure you should hit his video and see what he says about the property he'll present the same property to you um yeah no closing fees on it no dock no dock fees and that kind of stuff it's just it's ready to go nice looking property aaron english so if you guys are interested, Aaron English right there, hit it, go talk to him about the property. Um, 
Thank you for listening. Thanks for watching. It's Luke Smith, RuralVacantLand.com. Hit that subscribe button. I'll show you some more properties along the way. Thank you. Bye.